in a game yet uh, this year. Here's so it's his first start. It's only it's only six appearance so far this year. There's Aronson with a clear after a mildly dangerous play there in the box as Aronson takes control here over the midfield and gets it through to Christensen. There's Stuber. It said they have to bring some of those counterattack situations to fruition a little more often. Dangerous play there. That was Eric Palmer Brown that time booting it out out of Napoleon, Ohio, 23 years old. There is Aronson in the box. Gets it into the middle. Brown in there. Trying to get it out, but Koita as well. Yeah, but should be interesting with them going, going up against his, uh, another Red Bulls team. This one sent up. Palmer Brown heads it back out, but there's Koita getting into the middle. Aronson to Koita. The save by Pence and just able to get booted beyond the line there in the nick of time. Ebner with a foot and Pence with a fantastic save. Some great hustle from Ebner there. He thought that was a goal as soon as it came off of Pence's hand. But he makes a great defensive play to get back. You see everyone's onside there. What a play to get back and get to that ball first. I mean, and we can't underscore the impact that Aronson has had. I mean, I, from watching Red Bull from beginning to the, you know, to this point of the season, he really, I mean, he's had a looking to the middle camera with maybe a little bit of a light touch there, but ended up working out for him. Palmer Brown corrals towards midfield. The fact that it's still 0-0 zero, zero is kind of shocking. I mean, we've seen the coaching adjustments made by Peter Stoger and Jesse Marsh. A chess match, if you will, getting played quite a bit. Oh, look at that back heel by Aronson to keep that in play, and away he goes. He goes down hard, no whistle. Tough to see from this angle, but obviously Aronson, Aronson's looking confident out there right now. How about that, Ben? Felt Pretty good, I mean, I don't... I don't know what, but like, what else is he gonna do? Is that how impressive is that really? <laughs> he had no That's choice but to make a spectacular play. Yeah, I mean, I, of course we all we can all do that on the sideline, right? We're right. Playing yeah. pickup. When pressed, yeah, we all do that. Yep. When pressed, we, we yes. can we can pull them. So we'll see if they try and use them a little bit more uh, here down the left side, pushing maybe trying to push Aronson back. Make, uh, make him play a little bit more defense. Nice play there by Koita. That one sent up in front by Aronson and Palmer Brown there to corral that. Gets it out with his left. As Christensen gets it up there and Aronson finds himself in the middle and tries to cross it, but Palmer Brown is there just in time. It'll be a corner though for Red Bulls Altsburg. I think if you have American fans, you know, you have John Brooks, as the number one uh, player on the left center back depth chart. There he is once again, a trip of Koita in the box. We do have a whistle. And I believe they called an offside before the possible infraction here. See Koita step ahead yep. and hand goes up. So Palmer Brown doing yep. what he does. And that's close, but gets the job done when it all comes down to it. He captained the U.S. at the 2017 CONCACAF U20. Maida once again. Christensen into Aronson. Aronson, Palmer Brown takes it away, keeps it in, avoiding the corner. What a play by Palmer Brown. American, an American crime right there, EPP, uh, getting the better of Aronson. Uh, and Aronson is not known for you know, his, his quickness or his you know, speed. And here he just wasn't able to get past EPP. EPP gets out in front of him, pushes him off, uses that strength that Aronson you know, maybe doesn't have yet. Uh, but we'll see we'll see that again a couple more times in this game, I have a feeling. So uh, immediately, some energy from Salzburg coming out of the dressing room. Aronson to take this corner kick. First time he's taken it today. That one here, Poe sent in and on the rebound. Out of play, but a whistle going the other way. Manager for Austria Wien would attest to that. It's Aronson and Ulmer. Let Aaron to take the corner earlier, and he'll take this one too. Sends it in, headed by Palmer Brown, who we haven't mentioned him yet in this half, but that first half, Palmer Brown was really big on that back end for Austria Wien, the Napoleon, Ohio native, one of the two Americans playing here today. 
and Jesse Marsh. You can see Jess, Jesse Marsh is, uh, has a similar feeling to those passes. <laughs> Jesse Marsh confident in the talent he has here, though, a little bit down there. Aronson taking this one once again. That goes right, though, into the hands of Pence. 2021 season in his 14th match. Here's Aronson in the right side. Denied by Palmer Brown. That American-American matchup still waging there in minute 60 in Salzburg. Christensen here in the middle. Says it might have been deflected and doesn't get a call. But going back to the to the goal, yeah. Maybe he did. Uh, Sakaria is, is is really the guy that creates it, and you know he's he's he has four assists on the season. He's not going to get one there, but he's really the guy. Last 11 Bundesliga matches. Here's Koida. Koida trying to send it to Daka. Daka and Palmer Brown going at it. Palmer Brown gets it out. And he'll be down, clutching his leg for a moment. And there's a difference you see between a guy like Parisha and a guy like Daka uh, up top. He's going to put that physicality. He's going to make that pressure for the center backs uh, even, even harsher. You see Palmer Brown here. I don't think a foul was called. I think he has that control over the ball that you want in, a, in an attacking player. One of the league leaders in completed dribbles this year in Bundesliga play. Aronson working his way into the middle. Following it is Daka to Koida. Koida open. Koida scores. The equalizer. C. Ku Koida. Knotted up one to one in minute 65 here in Austria. That was quick. Uh, Daka comes onto the field and immediately makes an impact. Uh, we see Aaronson here with what we'll call a hockey assist. Uh, makes that little pass we've seen him make a number of times in this game uh, after getting through a defender. And Daka's able to find Koida uh, here on the back post all by himself. And they finally finished that chance they've had a couple times here in this game. That time, Aronson getting maybe a little bit of the better of Eric Palmer Brown as he stuck with the play, able to dish it off to Pat Sindaka, who found Koida. Oh, by his lonesome there. From Yanuzovic there. Uh, he, you know, again, I think, you know, maybe a little bit too central on the strike. Find a corner. Working his way in. Goes far right. Score! The first of his international career with a somersault giving Salzburg a two to one lead. Look at his teammates, Brendan Aronson, the American in Austria. What a moment for Brendan Aronson here. Uh, he gets the ball here on the wing and finds his first goal in Austria to put his team up two to one, bring his team back into first place for the moment. Uh, what a moment. Gave him a little bit of a shake and a shimmy. Goes of that right top foot. What a beauty there by Aronson. And he gives his team the lead. I mean, he, he, he puts, you know, it wasn't the prettiest. I wouldn't say shimmy I've ever seen in my entire life. But uh, he fakes him out just for that split second, which is all he needs. That's because Fire Spritz is playing him uh, to play him back. than Ulmer now. Sent back to Aronson now here along the left side. He gets free. And he's by his lonesome, gets it into the middle, and just barely missing it was Daka. Another great play here, one on one from Aronson. He gets by the defender. Uh, virus shits is going to have, is not going to be happy with this play against Aronson uh, here today. Waiting. Maybe to see what was happening after Jesse Marsh. Brought in some of those substitutes, and now here's Aronson with a lot of space and some time. Brings it up to the right, makes a move, sends it into the middle, and it goes right on through. This is an a goal over the weekend in the cup play. As Aronson checks out after goal number one, it'll ensue. Brendan Aronson getting goal number one in his international career, the game-winning one at that, and you saw it right here on FTF.